You remind me of a West Side Story. <laughs> How you guys doing today on this lovely day? It is hot as hell outside of Florida. Like it is hot. It's so disgusting how hot it is. Like you can't even breathe when you step outside. That's how hot it is. Like wow. What's the temp like where you at? Because out here it is blazing. Like legitimately blazing um so today i'm here um to make this video on my head to toe assessment i took my head to toe assessment last week um and i got one huh no that's like 10 but you know what i mean um i got 100 on my head to toe assessment so i kind of wanted to walk you guys through how i did it what we did um and stuff like that as you can tell i'm looking like a total extreme bum today no makeup no contacts my hair's a mess that's why i got this hat on it's my brother's hat though so you know i live for this hat um so yeah i just came from class from lab anatomy lab um but I needed to film this video for you guys. So here I am. So please excuse the bumminess. It is what it is. Um, but I got my stethoscope on here. Not like I'm really going to be doing anything anything with it. But it's just here. You know, for sure. Because it's cute. <laughs> so I have two weeks left of classes um, of this quarter. Um, I will be taking a final next week. And then I'll be taking a final the week after that. And then I am on a two week break um so i cannot wait i will definitely make a video letting you know guys know how my first semester was how i studied for finals what i got how i did you know the whole nine or whatever <laughs> um so i will definitely do a video on that and um let me know um i might vlog because i am taking a little vacay at the end of the month in june um so let me know i don't know if you know anybody likes my vlogs or anything like that but if you want to see a vlog let me know and i can vlog when i am on vacay so yeah anywho not too long of an intro nothing too crazy let's get into the video shall we <laughs> So like I said, I took my head to toe assessment last week, last Wednesday, and I got 100, basically. My teacher, she's super cool, she's super chill, she's super laid back, but yet we learn a lot of stuff in her class, which is awesome. She's not like uptight like other teachers, you know how, you know, like they are. Um, she's super cool, super chill, and it's crazy how much you learn when you have a teacher that's like, that's like that, you know what I'm saying? Um, so basically for our head to toe assessment, she didn't want us to like be super detailed. She just wanted to know that if we went out into the field tomorrow, that we would know how to do a basic head to toe assessment on patients. Um, so she was super cool. I was really nervous. I was like studying. I was studying on Ariana, you know, do it on her. Um, and I was nervous, but she's cool, like I said, and it was super simple. So we got into the sim lab. It was me and my partner, my partner, and then she's in there and there was a mannequin. I thought that we were going to do it on each other, but I guess you know we did it on the mannequin so basically what you do this is what i did i'm gonna run through the whole scenario how i did it um like i said she's not very detail oriented she just wanted to know basics so don't take this um video or anything like that as me trying to teach you anything like you know if you guys haven't done it or whatever obviously follow what your teacher says this is a disclaimer don't listen to me i'm just telling you my experience and what i did um and stuff like that and how i went through it and you know how i remembered stuff so this is what i did the dummy's there my partner's over here my teacher's sitting over here okay so i go i'm gonna run through it knock knock i come in hi my name is ariel i'm gonna be your nurse today and i'm gonna be performing your head to toe assessment um can you tell me your name please and then you know whatever i'll check the armband great wash your hands and then we'll start i said i'm gonna touch you is that okay you know i'm gonna be touching you just to let you know so first i started with the head so i went i checked the head you just want to check make sure if there's any lesions cuts scrapes abnormalities whatever then i went down 
to the face and check the eyes with my pen light check the um nasal open the mouth check the mouth check the ears you don't really have to have them smile to make sure that their smile is symmetrical then i went down to the neck i felt um for the pulse here felt the thyroid um felt the lymph nodes palpated the lymph nodes asked them to move their head you know flexion and extension um then i went down what did I do after that? We were supposed to do um, vital signs, but we didn't do it because it was a dummy and obviously we couldn't do vital signs. So obviously you would do your vital signs when you do your head to toe assessment. So your BP, your pulse, um, your oxygen, um, your respirations and stuff like that. So you would do that obviously, but we didn't do that. So I'm going to keep this out of you. Um, so then I went down to the upper part of the body. I checked the arms, you know, you're always inspecting the skin, you know, regardless. So I checked the arms, I checked for the brachial pulses, um, I checked their hands, I asked them to squeeze my finger, check for cap refill, make sure their nails, you know, aren't like crazy or whatever. Check the pulse, um, and then I went to the heart, then you're gonna, then I went and checked the five places of the heart. The dummy actually, you could hear like a heart sound, which was so cool. I was like, dang, what the heck? Um, but you could hear the heart sound and it actually had a murmur and it was super cool to hear because obviously you don't hear murmurs in everybody. So I checked the five places of the heart, one, two, three, four, five, underneath the breast. Um, then I went down, I said, okay, I'm gonna go down to your stomach right now. Then I went and listened for bowel sounds on each side and I palpated you know just to check the liver make sure nothing's inflamed or anything's crazy down there um, then you couldn't check the lungs on the dummy dummy but on the, at that point I would have lifted the person up check the lungs I think it's the six places in the back for the lungs um, and you know just check their back just to make sure that everything's straight no nothing wrong with the spine anything like that then I went down to the legs of the dummy. I checked the legs. I checked for the popliteal pulse, which is on the back of the knee. You check the dorsal pedis pulse, I think it's called, that's on top of the foot. Um, I checked their cap refills on their toes. The dummy had like messed up toes and I was like, oh my God, ma'am, no. <laughs> but she had messed up toes, so I checked the toes, checked for cap refill. Then I asked her to push on my hand, the dummy. I asked the dummy to push and then pull up on the feet just to make sure you know that they have force in their feet and then i think that is basically it and then i was done um like i said it was super quick literally it took both of us all together like 10 minutes tops like it was just super quick um like i said she's not very detail oriented so she just wanted to make sure that we knew what we were doing so i was happy you always have to make sure you wash your hands before and after um, obviously we didn't have like a sink with the eyes you know i did okay follow my pen make sure you go you know follow my pen good i learned a lot um and we did a good job so don't be nervous i think we have to i'm like jumping all over the place but i think we have to do head to toe assessments every semester um we have to you know check off on those i'm not really sure but i think that we do um so it was good i got 100 i have i think a 96 in that class so I'm super excited. My health assessment exam is next Wednesday. So like I said, I will be making a video on how I study, what I did, how I did, and all that good stuff for you guys. Once I'm done with all that stuff, um, if you have any questions about a head to toe or I'm here to help, um, I try to get back to everybody in a timely manner. Sometimes, you know, life gets you and I get busy. Um, but other than that, if you're doing a head to toe, you know, don't be nervous. Believe in yourself. Always, always believe in yourself. You can do it. Work hard. Study. You got this. Like, we got this. You feel me? We're going to be nurses. We got this. Work hard. Believe in yourself. Always. Don't let nobody discourage you. And if you got some friends that ain't taking it as serious as you, cut them off. You know what I'm saying? Anyways, this isn't a freaking rant video so anywho i hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know down in the comments box below anything else that you guys want to see i did get um a request from a subby about doing like nclex preparation video and i do have an nclex book so i will get to that 
soon I will have that out for you promise and um yeah if you have any other ideas what you guys want me to do anything you want to see please let me know down in the description but in the comments not in the description box in the comments down below anyways I hope you guys have a good weekend I love you guys to all my new subscribers thank you so much for subscribing to me to all my og subscribers i see you thank you so much for riding with me and supporting me i love you guys like for real your kind words and all that really mean a lot to me i'm so glad that i can help you guys out um and if you're watching this video and you kind of sort of liked it and you kind of sort of maybe a teeny bit like me you better like and subscribe this video don't be playing no i'm just kidding <laughs> besitos have a good weekend guys love ya i'll talk to you soon